The search for a killer is over. 30-year-old Janice Tabata arrested on suspicion of aggravated murder and illegal weapons possession in connection to the November 12th shooting that claimed the life of 37-year-old Edward Bamba. It was a love triangle. And, uh, Guam Police Chief Stephen uh, Ignacio confirming Tabata pulled up to the home along Chela Escuela, got into an argument with Bamba over another woman both dated, before allegedly pulling the trigger and shooting Bamba in the chest, killing him. We do know that they uh, actively use uh, methamphetamine. But the, the motive for the shooting and the homicide uh, had nothing to do with uh, the drug trade or the use of ICE. It had more to do with uh, domestic relationships. Detectives finding video surveillance to hone in on Tabata's car, a silver sedan that fled the scene. I want to assure the public that, you know, at all times, uh, the safety of the community is always first and, and, and foremost. And Ignacio admitting they knew who they were but looking for, you know, but kept that info from the community. So that, you know, he's not tipped off that we're actively looking for him and so that he doesn't have the advantage as we go out and search for him. Tabata keeping authorities on their toes. Since officers responded to the scene on November 12th at 8.15 Saturday morning, Bamba rushed to GRMC, but he didn't survive. Five days passed November 17th before Tabata's car was spotted in the Dededo area several times, police even trying to stop the car during one encounter. But the suspect sped off before hitting a patrol car. Officers found the car torched at the Ukudu pipeline area two days later. Monday morning, a woman walked into the Dededo precinct alleging Tabata and Dara Jean Padama abducted, held, and beat her before she was able to escape. The woman, police say, is the same one who dated both Tabata and Bamba. She was taken to GMH, forcing the hospital on lockdown for her protection. By Monday night, detectives spotted Tabata in a car with Padama at the Micronesia Mall. Police used federal and local resources to catch him. With the escalation of violence in, in, with uh, Tabata's actions, uh, we felt that it was necessary to put together uh, a task force specific, you know, pre pretty much to, to, for a manhunt. During his arrest, officers found seven grams of meth, but no murder weapon. Tabata also facing charges of attempted murder and kidnapping. Padama was arrested on suspicion of aggravated assault and conspiracy.